Every organization aims for sustainable growth. It's a constant focus on driving new revenue whilst minimizing costs. In fact, Gartner reveals that 66% of CEOs prioritize two critical things to drive that. One is their workforce, the second one is their digital opportunity. Surprisingly though, a stunning 75% of digital initiatives fall short of expectations and only 30% invest in their digital workforce. Take Google, Amazon or Microsoft. Their huge success is because of their talent. If this resonates with you, you're not alone. Let's take a closer look. Our findings uncover a hidden truth. A staggering 93% of technology leaders tell us it's not new technology like Gen AI. It's people and culture and talent that's holding them back to be successful. They tell us that they miss digital competencies, business acumen, and a culture of excellence to excel and thrive. They tell us that this is causing their budgets and support to be cut, their innovation programs to stall, and their digital projects to fail at scale. This is our core philosophy at Esper, where we believe, like you, that you don't build a business, you build people who then build the business. This ethos defines Esper's vision, a concept we call creating digital fusion, an organizational state focused on nurturing, attracting, growing critical talent and building a culture of high performance. It's about solving the issue in the only real sustainable way possible. It's about business acumen. It's about communication aptitude. It's about open collaboration and problem solving abilities. It's about creating that high performing team that can drive the future. Welcome to Esper Ignite, our signature based academy built for technology teams. Powered by Forbes, Wharton and Gardner, it empowers digital leaders and high potential technologists to grow and become more. It focuses on developing 14 very specific skills needed for the future and fostering an open collaborative culture, a high performance team. Come join us at Esper, become more, become your future.